don't know why I'm whispering. I'm just here on my own. Anyway, I just wanted to do a really, really, really quick live because I've managed to persuade my star guest to um, to do do some lives with me. Now I don't know whether she fancies doing it. Um... Hey, Chloe! Did you you sent me some chocolates, didn't you, Chloe? Thank you so so much. They've gone, gone, gone at weekend. Anyway. Anyway, what I wanted to say, hi Sue, I'm sorry, I'm just getting ready to start my clinic, um, so I'm going to have to be really, really quick, um, I just need to prepare a couple of things, but I've got some very, 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 very exciting news, very exciting news, I'll tell you what the exciting news is, and the exciting news, oh, I'm not supposed to, you're not supposed to see me in my uniform, are you? Um, very exciting news is that, is that, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a nana, I'm gonna be a nana, I'm gonna be a nana, there, she's let me, she's let me tell you, right, so my eldest daughter, Charlie, is about 15 weeks pregnant now, and I've persuaded her to do chat with Charl, I don't know how often it's going to be. I'm sorry I look really rough today because I didn't sleep that brilliant. I didn't sleep that... I know, Hayley, what am I going to do? I'm not ready to be a nana. I'm not ready to be a nana. She said, are you going to be nana or grandma? So anyway, that's been big news that I've been able to announce now. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And my sister said that I'm going to be nana crank. I'm going to be auntie crank and nana crank. What am I going to do if that sticks? Anyway, anyway, anyways. So she said I'm allowed to tell you. And the reason I really want her to come on alive. So I don't, I've never done it before with somebody else. The reason I want to come on alive is because I want us to go. Oh, I've got, a, I've got a runny nose. I've got a runny nose. The reason I want to um, do some lives with her is she... Um, she was really, really upset about one or two things. So it's lovely to be able to do some chats with my daughter on here for you guys because um, she's not in the trust. So I'm not her midwife. She lives um, she lives a little way away, so I've not been able to see her. And she was um, getting really upset about some aspects of the care that she's received um, and things that she wasn't sure about. Um, so I just wanted to share it with you guys. Let me turn my computer on. Let me just turn my computer on, ready. Ready for my first lady. Are we in? Are we in? Sorry. Not very professional, this, is it? Right, anyway. I just want it to be ready for when the first lady comes. Right, so anyway, so we're thinking tonight, seven o'clock. Hi, Charlie! Am I gonna be Nana Crank? Don't even bother daring to call me Nana Crank. Hi, Katie. Hi, Charlotte. Hi, Julia. Hope you're all well this beautiful um, Tuesday. It's not freezing cold. Anyway, I'm gonna have to go now because I've got one minute. My Let's see if my first lady has arrived. So let's see, let's see. And she's here, so I'm gonna I'm gonna leave you, but I hope you guys can join me because I can ask her because I'm not restricted by issues around confidential confidentiality and she's my daughter and she'll talk to you and talk with you with um about the things that she feels comfortable sharing. And hopefully it'll help you guys feel that us midwives are getting to know some of the difficulties that you face going through pregnancy and lockdown so join me with my join me on my journey to be nana crank nana crank right i've got to go speak to you soon bye